Good morning. cut this down good morning good morning good morning how's everybody doing we'll let Facebook go out there and do its thing and uh, notify some people that we're going live I'm gonna share with you a killer 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 objection how to handle any objection all right a lot of people go through uh, through different objections and they're saying hey how do I handle them? how do I handle them? how do I handle them? and uh, today I hope you got your pen and your paper ready um, I'm going to totally, totally help you crush it just like all the pros do with this killer uh, way to handle any objection. I don't care what it is, all right? It's very, it's a very sneaky way of handling it, but, uh, but I'm going to help you out this morning. Um, if this is your first time with me, my name is Randy Johnson, and what I do is I teach network marketers the mindset, daily habits, and secret sauce to build a network marketing business. And so... Um, have you been building a business and ran across uh, any objections? People give me any objections. If uh, if the answer is no, then you haven't been talking to anyone. All right, because people are always going to give you objections. Okay, so I want to help you out this morning. One of the best, one of the best uh, who uh, whoever did it. So what I'll tell you is <clears throat> the old adjective that people say that facts tell, stories sell. It's very, very true, okay? It's very true. And so, how do we get to stories, all right? So, here's the objection. I know you're waiting to say, hey, all right, get all that. Let's, what's, what's the objection? What's the, how do you handle it? Let's say someone says, I don't have the money, okay? I don't have the money to start the business, okay? Your reply is, hey, you know what? I really just don't know about all that. Here's what I know. I know that, and you tell a story, okay? You tell a story. I know Billy, you know, who was, you know, a single father, didn't have uh, the money. He was working two jobs, trying to figure out a way out, and he started working this business on a part-time basis, and next thing you know, he's blah, 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 blah. And then you go into, are you ready to get started? Okay? They say, I don't have the time. Randy, I don't have the time. I don't have the time to do anything like this. You know? You know, Joanne, I really just don't know about all that, okay? But here's what I know. I know that, and if you have your own story, say, you know what, I know I just really didn't have time when I saw this thing and I was trying to figure out how could I make this work? How could I make this work? Because I needed to do something different. I needed more time with my kids. I needed more time with my spouse. I needed more time for me, okay? And I knew if I didn't do something different, then nothing would change. Question, do you want something different? Are you ready to get started? Are you ready to make some get some more time in your life? Okay? And these are these are things. See, I hope you're getting what I'm saying. Even if someone asks you and gives you something like, "Hey, well, um well, how do what what well, 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 how do we get paid and how does that, you know, even if you know the answer, even if you know the answer to the question, I would advise against answering it. Okay? Well, well, I, here's what I don't. Here's what I don't know. Here's what I don't understand. How, well, well, how do we get paid? You know, I really just don't know about all that. All I know is I showed a couple people this. They decided to get started and they sent a check my way. So, I, you know, I really don't. I just know that we show people. Some people get started and they pay me. You know, are you okay with showing a few people and getting a paycheck coming into your bank account? Yeah, I'm okay with that. All right, then let's get started. See, it's a very killer slash little sneaky way of handling objections, all right? Because you really didn't go and address the objection, which objections people don't, people really rarely ever have a real objection. They're just, it's just a stalling tactic. It's just a uncertainty, you know, about themselves. Because if everyone was certain about themselves, they just sign up and get started, right? Unless they were already multi-millionaires or billionaires, then... Maybe not. But all I'm saying is, is if you handle the objection in that manner and you say, hey, you say, hey, here's um, 
here's what we're gonna do, okay? We're going to not address the objection directly, but I'm going to say, hey, listen, you know, I just don't know about all that. Here's what I know. I know that and insert a story. See, you get a lot of your stories from your company events, teammates who are doing well, okay? Your own, uh, your own personal testimony. Okay, all those various different things. Do you get what I'm saying? All those various different things help people out. They help people to understand exactly where you're coming from. If you can use that killer strategy to just just don't even address the objection. Well, I, you know, I, I got to talk to my spouse. Hey, you know, I just don't know about all that. Here's what I know. I know that that Mary. You know, she thought about talking to her spouse and then she said, you know what, I'm just gonna go out here and make it happen. And since then, she's been able to do X, Y, and Z, okay? Are you ready to go ahead and make a difference in your life? Yeah, 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 I am. All right, let's go ahead and get started. See, using those type of, um, those type of objections is very sneaky because you just never really address the objection. You just knock it out of there as though it doesn't exist, all right? And uh, hey, good morning, Rex, brother. How you doing, man? If you use that in that manner, I'll tell you, you'll have a lot less headache. People won't send you down this little bunny hole of objections. It'll just be, you just you just knocked it out like, hey, I didn't, it really didn't exist. It just really didn't exist. So remember, I really just don't know about all that. Here's what I know, insert a story. If you just become one of the best storytellers, okay, People will, people will just listen to the stories. They'll just follow you every single where because of the stories that you tell. The stories, and make them true stories. Don't, don't tell lies. I'm not telling you to tell. Tell true stories because you can go into any company and you'll see any background, any occupation. People who were, you know, um, chiropractors, people who were anesthesiologists, people who were former athletes, people who were military, people who were, you know, teachers. I mean, any background and that story will be there. People who were unemployed, okay? House arrest. You've seen every story. That's the beauty of network marketing. You'll see every story. You've seen all the stories, okay? You take those stories, craft them, become good at them, and then boom, all right, mother with six kids, there you go, okay? And that becomes a me too kind of a mentality to the person who you're communicating with. If they even can think, hey, me too, I can do this too, then they'll be ready to go ahead and get started with you. So listen, I truly hope that you got value. Make sure that you hit the subscribe button so that uh, you'll be one of the first ones to get notified. And um, if you are inside of network marketing and you're looking for good people to reach out to, make sure you head over to meetrandyjohnson.com, enter your name and email, Okay, I'm giving it away totally free. Uh, it's my hottest prospect, good people in 15 seconds or less. Uh, audio and PDF, I'll show you how to weed out people and find really good people to talk to about your business products or whatever, okay? So truly hope that you got value. We'll see you same great time, same great place tomorrow morning. Have an awesome, awesome day.